Lately I had some troubles running the Flatpak Unity, and more specifically it was giving issues with the sandbox, so I thought to switch to the official supported release that unfortunately comes with an app image. And it's really a big unfortunate thing when such large vendors are still not officially supporting Flatpak, but anyway! So I did download the cursed app image after all, and I placed it inside the apps folder, together with an icon for creating a desktop file later. But then I realized I was too lazy to create the desktop file. In fact I wasn't even remembering the properties, so I googled for an application. Finally I found this on Flathub, and there are links on YouTube description if you want it too. The app doesn't look very good, it's not even GTK4, but for now it will be enough to accomplish the task. So, I'm starting by putting a name, and calling it app image so I can recognize it from the flat pack entry. Next is the executable, which is this file right here. And then the icon, boom, magic. We don't need categories, and no display is for keeping it hidden from shell, that is exactly the opposite of what we want. So, create, confirm, and a message informing us where those files are stored, that are under local share and applications. All done from here, and if we now open shell we'll see both flatpak and app image unity. No namespace girl? Out! 